today in our most buffalo story of the day we are talking about something that is truly most buffalo tailgating bills fans have it down to a science slash circus act and with football season finally here the excitement is building to do things in a parking lot you would maybe feel a little weird doing in your driveway and that might have the potential to go viral on the internet the home opener may still be 17 days away but smart fans know that preparation is key and on that note you may remember in the spring the bills announced some major changes to their tailgating policy in case you forgot, they held a news conference today to remind everybody. The big headline in regards to the game day experience at New Era Field involves buses or limo buses. The new policy says if you and a bunch of your closest friends load up a bus or a limo bus to go to the game, that's cool, but you can't tailgate near it when you get there. Instead, you have to take the party to what is being called Tailgate Village which sounds like a ring of hell at the DMV. Nevertheless, the village a la tailgate is in the limo and bus lot. It may eliminate some of the uh, buses or the fans that have come in the past and have caused the problem, and maybe now they're not wanting to uh, opt into this plan, um, which, you know, if that does avoid the issues and help us out from the fan behavior st standpoint, make it safer uh, for the other tailgaters in the bus and limo lot, you know, that's a good thing. The new party bus policy also comes with a requirement for fans to buy parking permits in advance from tailgate guys. The cost is anywhere from $300 to $900 depending on how many passengers are on the bus. We're all about feedback. We want to know, hey, is, is tailgate village, is it fun? Are you having a good time? What do you, what do you think we can do to make it, make it better? We're open to all that. So I went on Facebook and I asked for your top tailgating tips and we got one solid tip about not forgetting the ice. But a lot of the rest of you advised staying home, arguing it's cheaper and the lines to the bathroom are a lot shorter. However you choose to cheer Buffalo this season, it won't be long now before the fun begins.